Friday shop walk around. Let you guys catch up on what's going on here. Start on uh, start on job car. People making noise, making it difficult. Yeah, usual. So, John's car front end is well. The front tube work is pretty much all welded. Uh, oh, I got the shock brackets on it. These are new, updated design for the shock brackets. Um, we're gonna put some fillers in those, um, but. So far, uh, it's about it on his, other than the front. Um, I've been working on the mounting the front end. Doors are open. It's nice outside. Um, but uh, I have, today I'm working on the end caps for the rockers. So in case you're wondering, if you just have your toddler uh, draw a boat, that's about what the uh, rocker end caps look like, but they work and they fit really well. So that's kind of what I've been doing today. Um, this morning I uh, fiberglassed the uh, tree in the front end for his car. Show that real quick. So. Still drying, still uh, tacky and wet, but that's all done. So the only thing that needs done on this now is uh, mounted on the back by the door. Um, and then the front end will be completely mounted on John's car. And uh, this well, the chassis is almost done. Uh, Matt just needs to finish weld it. And then uh, there's a couple tubes that got to go in, but it needs to get welded uh, before those tubes can go in. And then those will get welded. Uh, so far, this notch is working out great. Everybody's fighting over this one now because it works better. <laughs> so, you know, the whole purpose of getting the second notcher was so there wasn't a line, but now everybody's fighting over that notcher. So there's still a line because nobody wants to use the Bailey. Um, Matt is working on the floor structure for the next welded chassis on our fancy new table. It's pretty fancy. Seems to be going pretty nice. quite well because you just kind of set stuff in the clamps and it's just there. <laughs> I don't have to worry about being unlevel. Yeah, it's all level all the time. Yeah. It's pretty nice. Yeah, it's a time saver for sure. Yep. Got ourselves a new welder. Still a Dynasty, um, but it's a 210 instead of a 280 like the other one. Um, we just needed another one because with all of us out here working all the time, it's kind of annoying because you gotta switch welders back and forth in between cars and stuff. So just got another one. And uh, in the process of welding the table together, the AHP let out a whole bunch of smoke still works though so you know hey. it's gonna be the designated tacker <laughs> yeah. um, but Gavin's got this pretty well uh, done on the inside um, for the main part of it just need door bars and uh, then rocker bars we haven't decided if we're going underneath or on top of the floor yet but uh, that's about all that needs done on this because pretty well, pretty well fit. Luckily, we're able to do a, a straight dash bar. This fits behind the factory dash uh, with slight modification, but um, that was the best route we could see. So it's about the progress on the RCSB Chibi. And then... Uh, Richie's been knocking out cage kits because they keep uh, selling. The winter mill line is real right now. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, before, take, before. As soon as the cold weather, people are like, oh, take my car apart. Yep. Yeah. Downside, yeah. there's been a uh, cage in there. Yeah, it's been a while. It's been a lot of, uh, yeah. It's been like. As soon as it got cold. Yeah. 
yeah, soon as it started to get a little cool out, everybody's ordering. Like, we've had, what, like six this week? Four this week. Four this week? Yeah, yeah. it's, it's getting crazy. Oh, yeah. We, uh, we stocked up for wintertime because we were having issues there for a while with the tubing shortages. Uh, not being able to get it and stuff. So, yeah. That's, uh, that's 200 sticks of inch and five eighths. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot. So there's 200 sticks of inch and five eighths. We've already got our, I think, probably showed our inch and a half and three quarter and one inch and all that. So, yeah, it's a lot of tubing. It took like 35, 40 minutes for four of us to unload it off the truck. So, yeah, but we got tubing for hopefully all winter um, because we did, we added up all the tubing that we used up last year. So over the whole year, we used up like 50, 51,000 inches, I think, over all of last year. So we ordered, I think this is almost 52,000 inches of just inch and five eighths. Gavin's not here today. Um, he was in a uh, car wreck this morning. He's all good. Uh, he got checked out at the hospital. He's he's fine, but uh, he got rear-ended on the highway and uh, got pushed off the road and rolled his car a couple of times, but he got away with a minor injury, nothing serious. They released him from the hospital after like two hours. He's all good. Um, but he misses out on lunch today. Um, I think that's about it. We're just doing a lot of little stuff. You know, nothing doesn't look like a whole lot of progress is being made on the cars, but it's just, it's what happens when you get down to the nitty gritty, down to the little stuff, because it just, it takes a long time to do it. Um, but yeah, so. I think that's pretty good for this shop update uh it's almost lunchtime so we're getting ready to go but uh yeah like comment subscribe see you next time